Hello everybody. We would like to present the topic entitled Recent Developments in Utilization of Glass as Aggregate in Concrete Industry Effects on Sustainable Construction which have been prepared by Assistant Prof. Dr. Aishi Balkis, Mehmet Fatih Tuktash, and Aya Ahmed. We will start with the concept of sustainability, then the use of waste glass to replace the aggregate in concrete, and then the effect of waste glass on the properties of concrete. Sustainable development is the development that meets the need of the present without compromising the ability of future generations to meet their own needs. Now, construction industry tend to use alternative materials to reduce the carbon footprint emissions. So it is very important to use industrial waste wisely and efficiently. Preserving natural resources is an important responsibility for the whole world. These resources should be conserved to maintain ecological balance and save them for future generations. 13,000 tons of construction materials is needed globally per year only for the sustainable construction industry. Concrete plays an important role in the growth of infrastructure and industrial sectors. Concrete is one of the most widely used construction materials in the world. However, the production of Portland cement, an essential constituent of concrete, leads to the release of significant amount of CO2, a greenhouse gas. Every year, a large amount of waste is produced and most of this waste is non-recyclable. The use of waste materials as a cement replacement is a very attractive alternative because it, it saves energy, it protects the environment, it reduces pollution, it is slow global warming, it lowers waste products in the landfills. Using natural resources harm the environment. So extraction of large quantities of natural resources has resulted in continuous depletion of Earth's natural resources, which may lead to environmental degradation. Wasted glass can be recycled as a replacement for natural aggregates and cement, therefore reducing the amount of wasted glass dumped in the landfill, make exploration of natural aggregates unattractive, and also reducing the emission of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. A glass is widely used in our lives with the products like glass plates, glass bottles, glassware, and vacuum tubes. Glass is an ideal material for recycling since it helps serves energy. When the wasted glass are reused in the concrete production, the production cost of concrete will decrease. Also, it causes environmentally sustainable construction by using less natural resources. The disposal of wasted glass in landfills is an important environmental challenge. Over 50% of collected wasted glass in some parts of the world is still being disposed in the landfills. The use of recycled materials such as the broken glass in a place of aggregating concrete has presented itself as an innovative idea with multiple advantages. First, it has economic benefits, it reduces the construction cost. Second, its compatibility with other materials. That means the use of waste materials must not have any adverse reaction with other materials in the mixture. Third is the concrete properties. That means the ability of waste glass to take a part in alkali aggregate reaction. Now we will move for the definition of a glass. A glass is a hard and is a hard material, normally fragile and transparent, common in our daily life. It is an amorphous material with high silica content. These materials at high temperature fuse together, then they are cooled rapidly forming a rigid structure. The life of a glass is so short, so it should be recycled often in order to prevent the environmental disasters from its compilation. The use of a glass in construction industry has provided an innovative and environmentally friendly avenue for a glass disposal. The recycling of waste glasses in cement and concrete production offers several benefits, like 
It reduces the waste disposal costs, which are likely to rise due to the landfill tax. It conserves the environment by saving a large amount of the primary raw materials each year. It extends the life of our landfill sites by helping them to preserve the countryside. It saves a significant amount of energy and it reduces the amount of carbon dioxide and other air pollutants emitted from the manufacture of cement clinker. It reduces the use of natural material in construction. It increases the public awareness of the problem of waste and benefits of recycling. It offers many alternative uses for recycled glass-based products without compromising on either, either the cost or the quality. A glass powder should be used as a substituent for aggregate or cement in concrete up to 30% without any negative long-term effects on the concrete. The fresh and hardened properties of the concrete was studied. The study showed that there were an optimal economical effects at 25% replacement ratio of coarse aggregate by windows wasted glass. The use of wasted glass in concrete has significant influence in both the hardened and the fresh and hardened properties of concrete. Using recycled wasted glass as a partial replacement in self-compacting concrete revealed that the wasted glass content decreased the brittle nature of the concrete in comparison to the reference concrete. Low strength in a glass concrete could be attributed to the weak adhesive bond between a glass aggregate and the cement paste. The mechanical properties of concrete showed an increase in modulus of rupture due to improvement in the interfacial bonding between cement paste and aggregate and the glass aggregate also plays the role of the crack arresters stopping the cracks from advancing. Many studies concluded that the use of a crushed uh, wasted glass creates a good abrasion resistance and lower shrinkage in dry conditions in comparison to plain concrete. The low adhesion and the bond strength between the cement paste and the glass aggregate in combination with the relatively smooth glass surface alters the mechanical properties. Now, effects of wasted glass on the properties of concrete. Effect of wasted glass on the fresh and hardened properties are given from different researches. Slump test. The rise in wasted glass in concrete mixture decreased the slump value by about 0.2% due to the poor geometry of wasted glass and also it reduces the workability by about 1.5% in the study where a 0.45 water cement ratio was used with wasted glass as an aggregate in concrete. Regarding compressive strength, most studies have shown that the compressive strength decreases as the amount of wasted glass increases. It was found that 25% of wasted glass could be incorpor incorporated as a coarse aggregate replacement in a concrete in order to improve the compressive strength of concrete. The analysis on nine different mixtures of wasted glass in concrete which, are cl which were crushed at 5 mm to 20 mm demonstrates a maximum compressive strength around 268.14 MPa. Additionally, 13% wasted glass replacement recorded the highest compressive strength after 7, 14, and 28 days. However, the compressive strength increased by about 28.7% after 7 days at 10% glass replacement and there were no increase in compressive strength at 28 days. In context, some findings have shown that the compressive strength of concrete is also influenced by the size of the aggregate. This is attributed to the pozzolanic properties of wasted glass use. It was found that the concrete compressive strength has improved from 30 to 35 megapascal when the size of aggregate is at 80 micrometer. Now regarding flexural strength test, results from several studies shows that as the wasted glass quantities increases, 
the flexural strength of concrete decreases due to the reduction in adhesive strength of a glass particle. Contrary to most researches, a rise in flexural strength by 20% was observed when gla wasted glass and sheeted glass powder were used as, an, as fine aggregate in concrete. Previous studies shows that the flexural strength of concrete containing wasted glass increased compared to the conventional concrete where 13% partial replacement proved to have the highest flexural strength at 7, 14 and 18 days due to the increase in the amount of CaCO3 in the concrete. Splitting tensile strength test utilizing wasted glass as an aggregate in concrete produces variation in results with regards to its effect on the tensile strength. Results of several researches indicate that as the amount of wasted glass increases, the tensile strength of concrete decreases by 10% and by 37% due to its amorphous structure. Furthermore, several results have found that there has been a rise in tensile strength of concrete by 20% and by 25%. Thus, they concluded that as the percentage of wasted glass increases, the tensile strength of the specimen increases. Water Absorption Capacity Test Using wasted glass, reduce the water absorption capacity of concrete and restrict the movement of the micro cracks and the moisture migration. Also, concrete with wasted glass has lower absorption compared to plain concrete. Alkali silica reaction in wasted glass concrete. Glass and sand are concentrated with silica but behave very differently. This is due to the properties of silica and sand because the structure is regularly crystalline, which makes it stable and resistant to chemical influence. A glass, on the other hand, is an amorphous form which is not stable. This observation has been the topic of intensive researches. So the use of a glass powder in concrete has shown compromising results in mitigating alkali silica reaction in concrete. There are a number of measures to avoid alkali silica reactions like Grinding the glass to pass at least U.S. standard mischief number 50, adding mineral admixtures that can effectively suppress the reaction, making the glass alkali resistant, modifying the glass chemistry, sealing the concrete to protect it from moisture, using a low alkali cement, developing special alkali silica reaction resistant cement. To sum up, saving the world is a global issue and many stakeholders are looking for ways to limit energy use and reduce its impact on the environment. The general mechanical characteristic strength of concrete, which recycles wasted glass in older ages, was better than conventional concrete. Building construction is convenient and a profitable environment for using recycled wasted glass. Wasted glass are preferred because the total de dependent cement is not sustainable due to the high carbon dioxide emissions. Research and cost analysis should be done to confirm or reject the economic concerns of using wasted glass in construction. Glass, glass waste used for construction will help reduce the volume of wasted glass going to the landfill and will also represent the potential to reduce the amount of natural aggregate required for construction. Processing of wasted glass and moving it to the desired building construction resources may require higher energy consumption and also increase emissions. Finally, the government should also enact legislation that encourages the use of recycled material in construction, like mix ratios, glass shape and its size, type of processing the wasted glass should be defined. Thanks for your attention.